All right, ladies and gentlemen, now please welcome to the stage doing some, another uh, stand-up. Oh, yes, fabulous. It's Dave Matters! <laughs> Yeah, well, thank you. Thank you very much, ladies and germs. Um, I'm Dave Matters, and you don't. You know, they say, they say that you really, when you go to work, you ought to dress for the job that you want, not the job that you currently have. Uh, but I just, um, I have a hard time thinking I can get away with coming into work dressed as a lion whisperer. Uh, Dave, uh, Dave Matters, we, we're having a very important meeting this afternoon, and we need you to Xerox 100 copies of this uh, report uh, that's going to be presented. Uh, so please uh, do a good job, and you're going to need to collate and staple it. Uh, yeah, 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 boss, I'll do that. No problem, no problem. Psst, psst, Cecil, Cecil. I need you to make a hundred copies of this. Go, go to the copy machine, make a hundred copies and bring it back. Now, that's a good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Thank you. No, 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 no. I'll, I'll, I'll take care of the call It's okay. <laughs> and Cecil, what kind of a name is that for a lion? Uh, if you ask me, it was going to happen. Um, and, and his name isn't even Cecil. He wasn't even known as Cecil. This, this is the lion that got shot by that crazy guy in Minnesota or wherever he was. Um, and his name wasn't even uh, Cecil. It, it was pronounced Cecil. If he asked me, he was asking for it. And um, <laughs> you know, I, I, I know there are some. Uh, I know, I know there are some animal lovers out there, and I, I, uh, I really appreciate you. And um, sorry, but um, I, I tell it like it is. And. Uh, and <laughs> <laughs> and the thing is, uh, <laughs> um, oh, by the way, this is my a joke a flow chart. And uh, what it is, is it, uh, it helps me map my routine in case I get lost. And, um, you know, it's really tough, uh, tough being an impresario during the day. And then I have to prepare. This was a lot of work putting this together. Uh, so I apologize that I have this uh, flow chart. Um, so uh, the thing is that, uh, what's the thing is, uh, excuse me. Uh, ah, yes. Uh, <laughs> What, um, what, what I want to do, actually, is I want to change the face of comedy. Uh, that's my current um, goal, as, aspiration. Um, but I realized, I've, I've, st I've come to realize I may not, that may not stand-up comedy may not be the thing for me, because uh, the truth is I don't really care how you're all doing out there tonight. <laughs> and, uh, and I know that if you're at stand-up, you really need to care about that. And, and um, so... Uh, so I might not, uh, that might not work out for me. Um, now, it might surprise you that I'm single. Um, but, uh, but I have tried online dating, and, um, you yeah, know, everybody has. I'm, I'm not, I'm not uh, ashamed of it. It's, um, I've had uh, mixed success. I would say limit. I, I haven't really had much success at all. But, <laughs> but, but. <laughs> But um, but but the other day I saw this wonderful ad, uh, uh, you know, ad on an online dating site. A beautiful woman, lovely woman, elegant, uh, sophisticated, um, se seemingly intelligent, um, really perfect for me, really who I would like. And but then I realized that um, even though she was right for me, I might not quite be right for her. Uh, her headline said, um, well, not her headline, but the first uh, thing she said is, judgmental men need not apply. And it occurred to me that the first thing I had noticed, other than the p her picture, was that she had spelt judgmental wrong. <laughs> so, so um, she, you know, um, she might be right for me, but maybe I'm not really right for her. Um, which, which leads me to let you know. I know this, you really want to find out more about me. I mean, um, so the, th so I really, uh, the truth is I really do have excellent taste in women. Like I said, you know, beautiful, intelligent, and, and it's uh, from the inside out, you know, all that. All that yeah, but you also have to be pretty, pretty. Uh, 
I'm, I'm being honest. Um, and um, the thing is, the problem is that, um, so uh, I really have excellent taste in women, but the, the problem is that then they have excellent taste too. <laughs> so, <laughs> so, so uh, by the way, you're not supposed to laugh, and I really apologize. Uh, 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 you're not supposed to laugh at your own jokes, and uh, I'm, I'm working on that. I'm, I'm, I'll get to it. Um, the, other, the other strike against me is that um, I, and again, another thing I'm not really proud of is I've always, um, I've always liked, preferred, preferred younger women. Uh, not, not proud of it. A lot of men are like that, and they're pretty not so great. But, but that's me. And um, the thing is, but I, I realized that I can't, so I realized that at some point, a couple, um, maybe 10, 20 years ago, I decided that in order to make sure that I didn't like cross the line, in order that I didn't um, date, try to date someone too, too young for me, uh, I decided to deploy this, um, the, what I call the Kennedy rule or the Kennedy test. If she can remember where she was when she heard that Kennedy had died, then it's okay. Then, you know, I'm not being a creep. And uh, the reason it's worked for me is every couple of years I change which Kennedy. <laughs> so, uh, ga uh, Galaxy, you know, that's a uh, Galaxy, that's a young woman's name uh, in this century. Uh, Galaxy, do you remember uh, where you were when John John died? And she goes to me, well, yeah, I was at recess in kindergarten. Why? I said, I'm going, hmm, she remembers. Okay, that works. Um, you're not supposed to like Dave Matters, by the way. Um, <laughs> well, I don't know. I haven't figured that out. Uh, I'm almost done. Um, let, me see. let me check the rest of my joke float chart uh, and take my glasses off because I'm farsighted. Um, uh, okay, I'm going to skip that one. Uh, <laughs> no. Uh, <laughs> so that's okay. I can't see through them anyway. Okay, last joke. Um, so um, the, tr the other thing is that I'm not really good uh, boyfriend material. I figured that out. Um, what happens is... Um, Oh, why am I not? Oh, yeah. So uh, I'm not. I, I just empirically, I figured that out. So, so like I was dating this lovely woman uh, for about three months, and then um, I tried calling her one day, and it, she had up and moved back to Chicago and decided to become a um, a lawyer. Then uh, I met this other lovely woman. I dated her only for two months, and um, she up and moved back to Minnesota. And then uh, last summer. I dated um, a woman who had uh, come to New York from Hawaii, and uh, she moved right back to Hawaii. So uh, now I've heard from uh, United Airlines, and uh, they want to uh, set me up on dates. <laughs> and, uh, and, and the way it works is uh, every time I get dumped, I get double points. <laughs> uh, and uh, with that, I'd like to turn it over back to, uh, back to Miss Trudy. David Matters! Fabulous. That was hilarious and very educational. Thank you, David. Ladies and gentlemen, we love them so much. Please now welcome back to the stage Eileen Angel and...